The heading of Scranton girls basketball team is the favorite to win the Region 7 championship this year. They are off to a 5-1 start, which includes beating the defending state champs, Grant County. And that was on the road. Kenny Kowzerowski met up with the team and tells us how good things come in threes for Hedinger Scranton. Higher expectations mean more hard work for Hedinger Scranton. Practice is a lot harder. Yeah, um, they're pushing us a lot harder. But the Nighthawks love it. We're all like getting jacked for games. And the results prove it. They've already won the Rough Rider Tournament, which features a good chunk of Region 7 teams. And their top three players have all contributed early. The senior Clute runs the point. Teammate Sam O says she's the heart of the squad. Abby brings energy and intensity to our table. She's always the one to pump us up and get us going for sure. She's our playmaker. Ose is the six foot tall sophomore that owns the paint. She's a huge asset being six foot, so she can catch the ball. She can even dribble down the court for us if we need. And if the ball isn't going to Clute or Ose, it's probably with the junior, Alyssa Andrus. So athletic. She can drive left, right, spin off them, shoot. Yeah, everything. She's great at driving and just making the right play every time. She's smart with moving the ball and just looking to score. All three girls averaged double figures last season, and they're confident they'll get heavily involved on offense once again. We're a very transitional kind of team. We like to run the court a lot, and that means sharing the ball a lot. Their up-tempo style makes it tough for opponents to catch up. So with this experienced trio back on the floor, the Nighthawks don't just have their eye on another third place finish in Region 7, they want a title. It's a great group, it's the best group I've had in all five years I've been playing. It's all finally come together as a senior. Reporting for KX Sports, I'm Ken Kozarowski. Heading to Scranton goes for their fifth win in a row Saturday at Lemon, South Dakota.